Hi everybody, it's Anna. Um, I just wanted to share with you a video about um, me applying natural medicine that is homemade on my son. There was an incident that we had and he, he needed some med medication on our camping trip and I wanted to share with you what it is that I do when we're out camping and we have our first aid kit and I use our natural homemade medications um, that I, I make. I grow plants, I make all kinds of things with those. Um, I do my harvest and dry and I make infusions, tinctures, salves, creams, um, um, even household goods like uh, dish soap. From time to time I'll make laundry detergent, I'll make beauty products, I make all kinds of stuff. And anyway, I have a lot of fun with it. Um, for this time, this round, I brought in um, plantain, colloidal silver, um, Indian clay, apple cider vinegar, and some homemade um, hand, hand sanitizer. And so I use all of these things to apply to his finger. And in this video, it's, we are at our camping trip and I demonstrate exactly what we have to do to take care of that problem. So anyways, enjoy the video. Thank you, bye. So there's, there's the aloe vera. Good job, baby. Let's close it. This is from the plant that actually Scarlett cut a few days ago and we made aloe vera gel and mixed some of this health shield in it. And that is a natural hand sanitizer. It's just a sanitizer in general, but it's perfect for hands because it, the gel evaporates just like a uh, chemical sanitizer does. I am good. It's the same thing. The kids love it. So, Daddy, can Daddy. you show me? Can you show me what happened to your finger? Yeah. Okay, where is it? He got poked. Where is it? You see that? He got poked by. Where did you? What did you get poked by? What right there? What happened? What right there? Was it from a hook? From a fishing yeah. hook? Yeah. Yeah. So Let me see. you all know what that means. Let me see. That means skating Let green. Let me see you. We'll watch the video when we're done. Here, Danny. We're going to add silver, which actually we already did. So we added silver to that, a drop of silver. Um, that's going to stop the infection from spreading. Okay, so he is... <laughs> you gonna take silver? Here, <laughs> let's, let's not touch that. Okay, so now what we're gonna do to dry out any bacteria is I'm going to use apple cider, clay, that's Indian clay, or actually this is French green clay. Um, and that, that's what draws the toxins out. And I'm gonna also mix it with the plantain that I harvested about a couple weeks ago. So uh, for this, we're using it for the detoxifying effects. It draws out any kind of bacteria that's sitting in there, any poisons. So if these two in combination is perfect. We're gonna do the same thing. So this is uh, what we're going to make the paste with. So we're creating a little paste and then we're going to apply that. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, after the second day, I did a hot compress on his finger, and that um, that had that made his pores open so that I can easily squeeze out the infection or the pus. Um, it was a, a little bit painful for him. Um, he was actually more scared than anything. But once, it, it took only a few minutes, once that was over, his finger was so much better. I had applied silver on his finger for about five days to keep um, the bacteria from coming back. That's just how you use silver. So I hope you enjoyed. He's completely fine. I know it can be very panicky to have something like that, like a fish hook poke you, especially because we don't vaccinate. So, you know, you think of, of gangrene or, or really serious infections. However, 
I'm not scared. I know what I'm doing. I understand how my medicines work. I know uh, I've done so much research on this stuff. I know what to do. So of course, I'm always calm about it. And, and uh, you know, his finger was taken care of, care of within days. And taking colloidal silver really helped keep the infection at bay. He's completely fine. <laughs> So um, that's just our round around here. You know, anytime this happens with the kids, I just, I do my round with them and take care of stuff, stay on top of it. That's important. You have to stay on top of it. You know, like I say, you have to um, apply the medication several times during the day, um, you know, three to six times a day. And then you stay on top of um, uh, the antibiotic stuff, which is like colloidal silver, because we don't use antibiotics. but. Uh, colloidal silver is a natural antibiotic, so that is my go-to for very serious infections. Anyway, thank you for listening. Namaste.